Hey guys, Raiden here, and welcome back to the Witcher Enhanced Edition. Now, last time, I went to go talk to Thaler, and asked him about some stuff. He didn't really feel like he wanted to fully comply to my needs. So anyway, we're back at the Grave Digger, and I did this off camera, but after I got drunk at Thaler's, I, it took about 15 minutes of walking before I could get to a bed. So, I'm not going to do that again, but basically... I gave him the alcohol, and he said, all right, I'll dump the bodies off by midnight. So, I'm going to wait till midnight, and I also have another idea. What's this? It's a bunch of bodies that you probably hung up to yourself, so you should know what that is. Anyways, we're going to go to the inn, and then we're going to go and get this autopsy done on the body. Good thing Shawnee knows what to do. Anyways, let's rest up till midnight. Here we go. Saving. Any refine. And rest till midnight. So I've been looking at a lot of the Witcher 3 gameplay, and I'm pretty astounded. And I'm also happy that they're not, or at least they're saying they're not going to turn this into a Dragon Age Inquisition. And what what do you mean by that? I, I know I talked about it before in the Let's Plays, but in Dragon Age Inquisition, my main problem, the main story was too short, and 80% of the game was side quests. So, I hope that doesn't happen with The Witcher 3. I believe it won't. I'm hoping at least 40% of the game will be the main story. I mean, that's hopeful, but that's just me. Or at least there's 50 to 60 hours for a main story. Alright, let's go check at the hospital, because that's where he said he dumped the body at, so... Hopefully he did his job and didn't neglect it like everyone else in this awful town. Oh, Shawnee's actually here. Awesome. I was thinking that I forgot to tell her to come by. Ready for the autopsy? Let's get started. We'll begin in a minute. Sorry. Race, human. Gender, male. Wounds, extensive. Shawnee, this isn't a lecture hall. Whatever you say. He died yesterday, torn to pieces. The bone marrow has been sucked out. Must be scavengers. Very likely. Plenty around the cemetery. So, he was torn to pieces after he died. I'm interested in the cause of death. I also see some stab wounds. A blade... two fingers wide. External signs aren't everything. His neck muscles and palms look tense. How do you know when he died? Normally, I base it on muscle stiffness and dehydration, but rigor mortis is persisting for too long. They say successful autopsies are based on curiosity. Should we look? Let's check his internal organs. Alright, go look at his internal organs. Why? That doesn't... The symptoms are peculiar, and the cause of death, too. Those wounds are too obvious. I suspect something more. Poison? If so, a rare sort. Perhaps an alchemist's brew. Kolkstein? Ah! Liver's completely cirrhotic. It was obviously a potent poison. This stinks of alchemy. Oh. Any way to confirm that? Yes, alchemist's poisons usually cause certain characteristic changes. Then let's check for those. Alright. If this ends up being Kolkstein, I'll be wrong all along. Look, the tongue was crudely extracted. But not all the blackened tissue was removed. Blackened? Yes, the poison caused necrosis of the tongue, so the murderer removed it. So we're certain a gifted alchemist is the murderer. A gifted alchemist? Who's a crappy surgeon? Kalkstein. 
He wanted to implicate the bandits, but he failed to foresee a professional autopsy. Thanks, Shani. That's the evidence I needed. Oh, wow. Good. I'm exhausted. Now we know who it is. The autopsy proved Kalkstein was the murderer. Kalkstein's guilty. I need to pressure him. Alright. Well, there's... Before I do that, even before I do that, I want to... There's actually something I want to do. I want to tell Ramsmeat that he's innocent because we just proved Kalkstein guilty. I really didn't expect him to be behind all of this, but... There's something that he doesn't want me to know. Something that he's doing with Salamandra that he doesn't want me to know about. Looking... I'll be good. There's an easier way. I could pay these guys to get in. Or I could just murder them. Oops. I prefer option two. Saves me money. Damn it, I like this. There we go. And they He has a key to Ramsmeet's house. So now I can get in whenever I feel like it. And Ramsmeet is here, wonderful. What do you want, Wolf? Want the truth about Salamandra? I'm listening. Someone wanted me to believe you led Salamandra. And I thought Salamandra sent you. Hmm. That's interesting. They really liked me out of the saddle. They tried to poison me and sent several masked assholes out to assassinate <laughs> me. But that's all too little for Uncle Ramsby. I thought you were their next attempt. I know you're fighting Salamandra. I'm hunting them too. Javed wants to take over my business. He decided to start with the girls. Know why? Though he left Zerakini a long ago and trained to be a mage, deep inside, he's remained a fucked up wild man. Now you get it? Not really. Yeah, not he's really. by instinct. Things with that Zeracanian cock of his, and he's got some strange fetishes. Likes fire. My girls are scared shitless, and they don't scare them. Oh, man. Thanks. That helped. No problem. So it seems I can't even entrust the investigator anymore. See ya. That's not a good sign. I wish I could have read what that said. I could probably read it in my journal. Anyway, let's go confront Kalkstein and go confront Detective Raymond about what's going on. So, which one's closer? Well, I guess I should go to Kalkstein's first. And tell him that I think he is a lying alchemist. So, I've been reading a lot of the Witcher books lately, and I hit a spot which I thought was very peculiar. Well, this game doesn't seem to go in depth as to what a Witcher is, and not. I'm not saying that it won't happen, but so far I haven't seen a lot hmm. of talk about what Witchers Sorry, are. I got lost and in, in the fact. very first book, which a lot of people advise me not to read, *The Blood of Elves*, there's actually a section with I can't. I'm not going to spoil it, but basically it gives this really cool meaning to what a witcher is and it links to elves and it's super cool you guys should take a look at that book alright anyways before we get him to hate us is there anything we want from him uh second volume of work on necrophages it provides information about algals I cannot afford any of this stuff I really can't so we're just gonna have to Accuse him, then. I suspected you were working with Javed. You think I lead Salamandra? I'll die laughing! I'm certain. You don't fool me with your scholarly guise. You're a fool, Geralt. I should keep an eye on Kalkstein. Yeah, I know. He's acting very strange. He called me a fool. I expected him to deny it more, and I didn't expect him to just go to sleep after I accused him. 
Anyways, let's go talk to Detective Raymond now. Where is Detective Raymond? Right here. Yeah, he seemed a bit fishy, but not fishy enough to me. I really want to get to the end of this case and figure out what's going on, because I'm super curious. Alrighty, tidy, let's go inside and... Probably upstairs. We're gonna have a lot to talk about, Mr. Raymond. Yes? I have the autopsy results. And? I'm certain it was Kalkstein. How do you know? The liver was cirrhotic. The stab wounds were just a clumsy attempt to hide the real reason. So, poison after all. But how can you be sure it was Kalkstein? Changes in the eyeballs. Typical of alchemical poisons. I see you did your homework. I sure did. Come back later. I need to analyze this information. Not now. Alright, I guess he wants us to come back later. Which we shall do. So, I should just rest up a bit and come back. Because there's going to be a lot of stuff happening. I have a feeling we're reaching the grand finale of this chapter. Maybe not even this chapter, but of this mystery. Now, there's something I want to check. I want to check if I can go in Shawnee's house at night. Because I, when I was drunk, after I got drunk with Thaler, I tried to find a place to rest, and Shawnee's house is the closest place. That old lady said I wasn't welcome in there after that, because I stumbled into her house drunk. So let's see what happens. Hello, precious. Do you go upstairs? Okay, I guess she changed her mind. Because last time I showed up drunk here, and she's like, never come back again. You need any help, need that's a new help. option. I'd like to ask a favor. I'm listening. Remember Dandelion? Well, we're trying to organize a gathering. A gathering? To reminisce, have a few drinks. However... Lacking the drinks? You guessed it. And I don't want to serve just anything. What do you need? Cherry vodka for Dandelion. Rosé wine for me. And something for you. I'll try. I'll try? I don't know where to get that stuff. Rose wine and cherry liquor. What do I have right now? I'm just kind of curious. Nope. Bottled water, bottled water. Is that rose wine? I have no idea where to find that cherry liquor. I have absolutely no idea. Anyways, we're not going to focus on that, right? Oh, we came up here to rest. I almost just left. Without doing what I came here to do. Yes. Yes, I want to go to sleep. Or just kind of sit and stare at this fire for a while. Ooh, new talents. Let's take a look. We have six bronze talents and one silver talent. All right. Where do I want to spend these talents is my question, though. Um, I don't quite want to upgrade Propel yet. I also don't want to upgrade my Intelligence. Let's put some stuff in stamina. I want to get this intoxication trait. At first I thought it was dumb. But now I realize how bad it is when you get intoxicated and how much it takes to recover from it. So I'm starting to think it's not too dumb anymore. Alright, we're lacking a little bit in our silver sword tree. So let's go ahead and upgrade it. Let's upgrade deep cut so extra bleeding. Apparently when you catch someone on fire, the damage is plus 40%. Sounds nice. Um, upgrade damage again. And let's go into fast silver. Upgrade damage. And... Group silver. Upgrade knockdown. Now, I don't know where to throw this last silver talent, because I know I threw a silver talent in this tree, in strength, so maybe I should just go ahead and throw one into dexterity or stamina. I'm not entirely sure where this should go. Just to be safe, we'll just throw it in dexterity. Alright. And let's wait till around dusk, I guess. 
and hope that Raymond is ready to talk to us about this investigation that he had so much time to think over. Alright. Hello, Shani. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Alright. So, I'm not sure about Raymond. I mean, he seems like a pretty straightforward guy. But I feel like when I start confronting him about these weird rumors about him, he's supposed to start getting really fishy. That's what I think is going to happen. I was wrong about Coxine, so I'm probably going to be wrong about this, and he's perfectly fine. But who knows. Hello, double priests. Boot black. Nice to meet you all. I can't wait to meet Dandelion. I really can. Hmm. Mere deduct. Here at last. Mm hmm Listen, I got it all figured out. Cal Steen and Ramsmeet were associates. I have irrefutable evidence. What do we do with that information? We set a trap, though it might be dangerous. Gather your equipment and come back. All right. Yes? All right. I find your reasoning somewhat flawed. Witcher, don't get me wrong, but this is hardly my first case. I'm in my element. Been waiting in this bog for years. Hmm. I'm good at what I do. I don't go around telling you how to hunt monsters, do yeah, I? Yeah, that's really fishy that you monsters. won't tell me. And I know how to handle this case. That you won't tell me about things going on. You won't tell me why he suspects ram meat, ram's meat at all, because so far we've had no connection between ram's meat and Salamandra, he seems to be rather surprised that Salamandra isn't... That I'm not working for Salamandra. He seems really surprised at that. So, I'm starting to question the detective here. Something's been worrying me. Speak freely, Geralt. You can trust me. It's you. I have the impression you've changed. No reason to be shy. Tell me. I've heard some really vile rumors about you. Something about girls. Oh, that. Rams meets revenge. I investigated one of his underlings. Now they want to discredit me. Don't worry about that. You mean all those strange things you supposedly do? Come on, Geralt. I'm the first to admit I'm no saint, but I don't get into nasty stuff. That's not my only concern. What else? Recently, my medallion has vibrated every time I've come here. Must be my warning amulets. Salamandra's men could attack it. Warning any amulets? It vibrates a lot. A master mage made these amulets. They're not Saint Labiota's tailbones or other crap from the market square. That's not my only concern. What else? That also doesn't make any sense. I don't know of any amulets that just vibrate when Salamandra's near. And on top of that, usually amulets only detect magical yes. or creature presences, as were. All of his amulets apparently just detect random men who are evil? That doesn't make much sense. I wanted to ask you about the commander of the Royal Guards. I saw him in town some time ago, busy bashing perverts. How come? What don't you understand? Everyone knows the Guard Commander hates anyone he can call deviant. Everyone knows, but few care. Yes? Alright. We'll speak later. I'm gonna save, and I'm gonna say I'm ready for ram's meat. I've cat. I don't really have any swallows, though. I'm a little bit worried that I won't have the necessary ingredients. Here, I'm gonna yes. ask him if I can. We'll speak. All right, we'll save, and then we're gonna try this whole ram's meat ordeal. I don't really trust that I'm ready for it, but I don't have much to lose. So, let's just do this. Yep. Yeah. I'm ready for Ram's meat. Good. He leads Salamandra's armed force. You have to kill him. I'm not ready to do that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is there a chance, or a choice, that we can go and talk to Ram's meat? I'm trying on thin ice. I need to close my suspicions... 
to, uh, to the detective, but I don't want him to react violently. Not yet, that is. I have to choose my words carefully. Well, you know what? I think that's actually the only option is to go and assault Ram's meat. But, I'm gonna- I wanna go talk to Ramsbeat, I'm, I wanna go see if it's an option. If it's not, I guess I'll just come back and do this. I also wanna talk to the herbalist to buy some ingredients. So, let's go talk to Ramsmeat, which isn't over there. He's over here, and oddly enough, his position disappeared from the map. That's quite odd. It used to say Ramsmeat's house right there, but it no longer says that. Can I even go inside anymore? I guess I can. Is he here? What do you see? It? No, we have to go through with this. This is our only option. All right. Well, let's head over to the herbalist and stock up on some potion ingredients because I need to be able to make a few swallows before the fight. And also, see, herbalist should be right around here. I think that's all I wanted to do, and then we're going to go ahead and go through with this assault. Society, I'm quite excited to get started on this, and I want to see how it goes. This episode might end up being more than 40 <laughs> minutes. It might be the grand finale for Chapter 2 we've been waiting for. Or well, I might have to stop it midway because it starts getting too long. Who knows? Oh, here we go. Um, where is she? Where is this woman? Where are you, lady? I'm actually kind of surprised that the herbalist isn't out here. Is it because of the time of day? Hmm, well, I think we can do without it. I'm probably going to regret saying that soon enough, but you know what? I feel like we're ready. I feel like we are properly leveled for this. And I feel like we can take take on some rams meat. We can eat some rams. So let's go to the detective's house. I will save and we will attempt this operation. It's elementary. Here we go. Yes. I'm good. Won't be easy, but I'll. I have to kill Ram's meat. Well, does that give me any sort of objective at all? Besides going to Ram's meat's house and start attacking him? I feel like this is an obvious trap. But I'm gonna walk into it anyway. All right, so that's behind us, actually. Oh, life! I know what you mean, man. Some days I just feel so lazy. I leave the food out on the floor. I leave slices of pizza on the floor in a line, so that way in the morning I have motivation to get to my doorway. That is not a true story. Do not take that. Here we go. I'm a knight of the order away. What's going on behind me? Who are you? Where am I going? I started singing and then I dozed off and I walked past Ramsmeat's house completely. Hello. Wonderful birds in the sky. Will you help me kill Ramsmeat? Or are you working for him? Well, here we go. We're about to arrive at Ramsmeat's house. Should I tell him I gotta kill him, what? or should I just start attacking him? See. I guess I just start attacking him. That's one down. Let's use a group style. Okay, let's see what 
Oh my goodness. This is ridiculous. I should have planned this out. I should have planned this out. There is no way I'm winning this fight. There's just too many enemies. Did I kill Ramsmead? There's no way. I'm never gonna like do this. Well, I tried. Next time I'm gonna prepare more. I'm gonna end this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Leave a like if you like this short episode. Uh, the series has actually been going on quite a decline. I've lost a lot of viewers, it seems. But that's fine by me, because those who really want to watch it and in and are entertained by my voice and commentary. Thanks, and good luck to you. Good luck to you, it's my video. Why am I... Anyway, see you guys in the next video.